just created a 15 minute film in three minutes with one hand. What's going on here? <laughs> I'm what's going on here? It feels like cheating. Look at the video that I just created here, you can see in the box. It has four minutes of watch time, and it was all done for me. Professional voiceover that sounds real, not stupid, real voiceover. To help us navigate this intriguing terrain, we'll be drawing insights from none other than Robert B. Cialdini's best-selling book. I'm gonna show you from A to Z, step by step, how to create an entire YouTube channel that you can monetize, make money with, and it's faceless, and you can create these videos, long 15 minute films in only three minutes. Okay, to actually make the film, we're gonna go to ai.invideo.io, and you make a free account. Then what comes up is a very straightforward, simple, and sleek work board. Then choose from one of these workflows, YouTube Shorts, YouTube Explainer, or recent events, or script a video. Okay, and let's put in 15 minutes for this one. Let's make it nice and long. because We really want to hit that long logarithm on the YouTube channel. So next, we're going to tell ChatGPT what kind of video we want to produce. And in the prompt, we're going to type something along the lines of, uh, give me seven uh, psychology uh, tricks and powers of persuasion that helps you make friends and influence people and refer to Robert Cialdini's book, The Influence, The Power of Persuasion. And in the second box, you can give it more instructions just to tailor it, make it a little more your own. For example, I told ChatGPT to use prop, uh, pop culture references and make it humorous and fun and entertaining. We're almost there. We just have about four more boxes to fill in to produce our video. Next, I filled in the music that I wanted. I said inspiring. And then the next is the voices we can do man woman we can do uh, american midwest coast california um australian uh, i think for this one let's do uh, british rusty of man's voice and for subtitles i think subtitles helps in the videos quite a bit so i'm going to choose a subtitle and there's a couple different options as well for subtitles go ahead and select that and then finally the type of stock footage we want to use uh, iStock has millions of video footage that we can choose from so I think I have a subscription, so I'm going to um, choose all the footage and then hit the generate button and it's processing, processing, it's thinking, prepping the video for us. And it has three more quick questions just to help tailor it a little more. So it's asking for an audience. So I think self improvement seekers, let's do that one. The look and the feel, uh, let's go with uh, fun and inspiring. And then the platform will be YouTube. Okay, let's go ahead and hit that blue button and generate. And I just sped it up for the sake of the video. It's processing, processing. Here we go. Ever wondered how you could make more friends and money using psychology? Well, wonder no more. Today, we're delving into the fascinating world of psychology and its profound influence on our everyday decisions. Imagine being able to understand the invisible forces that steer our actions and even better being able to harness these forces to your advantage. Sounds like a superpower, right? But it's not as far-fetched as it seems. It's all about understanding the human mind. And that's where psychology comes in. Now, you're probably thinking, psychology, really? Isn't that just for therapists and researchers? Well, not quite. You see, psychology isn't just about understanding mental health or conducting lab experiments. It's about understanding people. It's about figuring out why we do the things we do, why we make the decisions we make. And once you understand that, the possibilities are endless. To help us navigate this intriguing terrain, we'll be drawing insights from none other than Robert B. Cialdini's bestseller. From the power of social proof to the allure of scarcity, from the comfort of consistency to the pull of reciprocity, each principle... Okay, so that was what it looked like. So now there's a few options. If you want to tweak it, you can. In the bottom, after the video is produced, there's a few options here. You can see I can delete scenes, I can swap out videos, I can move things around. Or I can even give specific directions. So, for example, let's um, swap out a video that uh, really doesn't fit of the two people shaking hands. And I want something more engaging. So I'm going to tell ChatGPT, uh, let's swap out the handshaking video and replace it with uh, a zoomed out drone shot of several people, um, friends on a mountain. And there it is, voila. It uh, understood exactly what I wanted and it replaced it with a great uh, picture that I prefer. 
I can also um, cycle through all the video clips in the entire film and find any that I don't like. I can swap them out and upload them with my own if I have particular videos that I need to add, which is a really cool feature. Just click those three little dots on one of the video clips and then simply upload from the laptop or your device. Or I can also just search the actual database uh, for a particular video I'm looking for. So let's replace one of these videos with a um, with a video of a man giving a gift. So I did a search and I found a couple options here at the bottom and I simply uh, click and drag and move it to the video um, that I want to replace and voila. Now this is really cool as well. You can actually go in and look at all the text in the entire script, the entire film, and replace any words, any misspells, any grammar problems that there might be. Or just if you want to um, change some of the vocabulary, you can go in and edit that. And of course, the voiceover will adapt to anything you change in the text, which is really cool as well. So a lot of final tweaks here to really make it your own. It's uh, really powerful. Okay, so now that you know how to make awesome films in no time, how do you actually monetize the YouTube channel and get it bringing in some money? Good question. I think it's better that I actually let my new tool that I just showed you explain. So let's go. All right, buckle up, video creators, because today we're diving into the fabulous world of YouTube success. So first things first, let's talk about niches. Yeah, those cool corners of content that can make your YouTube pockets jingle with that sweet muller. Picture this, a humor channel versus a how-to-make-money channel. Now, I love a good laugh, but let's be real. Advertisers are throwing cash at money-making channels like confetti at a celebration. Now, let's explore the red carpet of popular niches. We are talking about jet-setting travel, heart-fluttering relationships, money moves in investments and trading, day trading too, and the intriguing history channels. It's like a VIP party and you're on the guest list. But hey, what if you're passionate about a niche that's not on the A-list? Fear not, my friend. Grab your virtual magnifying glass and head over to your YouTube channel. Look left and voila, there's the menu. And under analytics, you'll find the golden ticket. Research. Click on that bad boy and bam, you've got the YouTube search universe at your fingertips. Type in your niche crush. I mean term. Let's say success. Voila. You're showered with search terms that people are hungrily typing in. Pick the ones with high search viewability and you've just hit the jackpot of content ideas. So, to sum it up, spice up your content by diving into the juiciest niches. Remember that money talks in the YouTube world and use the research tool like a YouTube Sherlock Holmes to uncover the hottest topics. Get ready to rock that YouTube stage and may your videos shine brighter than a disco ball at a 70s dance party. Go get them created. That is really impressive. That was all done for me and it only took me a couple of minutes. I love that video. Final step you're probably wondering now is how do you actually monetize your YouTube channel? It's real easy. You're gonna take advantage of the ad revenue share program with YouTube, which means once you've had 4,000 watch hours on your YouTube channel, you can apply for the ad revenue sharing program and be part of it and get paid passive income for people who watch your video. Uh, what happens is advertisers will compete to advertise on your channel and you'll get a portion of those proceeds when they um, YouTube makes money, you get some as well. That's it. So what do you do to get that 4,000 watch hours? It's real simple. One, you want to make sure you have a really good click-through rate so people are actually clicking on your videos. And two, you want to have really good watch time. Now, the first part, the click-through rate, you, to do that, you need to have a really good thumbnail, a really good title and a really good thumbnail. So make sure that you spend some time creating a nice thumbnail. You can use Canva. It's a free tool and there's tons of tutorials on how to use Canva. It's pretty basic, so I won't spend a lot of time going into that. But that's what I use to make my thumbnails. That will ensure you get a high click-through rate. And to get the high watch time, that's already taken care of for you with the NVIDIA. NVIDIA, my NVIDIAs are getting high watch time. So they're already doing the job for you. You don't need to worry about that too much. So those two things will make sure that your videos are getting watched and getting pushed out. And only all, and in a matter of time, you're eventually your channel will pick up steam and get more and more views, more and more traffic. And eventually you'll hit your 4,000 watch hours and then you'll be well on your way to um, monetizing your YouTube channel. So hopefully that helps. And in the description, if you have any questions, any comments, any concerns, just put them in the comments. I will get back to you and answer them as soon as I can. All right. Hopefully that helps and I'll talk to you later.